What's this one? Holy moly, what's that? Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel where today you and I are going to experience something together for the very first time. We're going to have a listen to the original 1990s sounds of this Viscount organ. Something that I've never done before. I've never heard them. I don't know what they're going to sound like and I suspect they will sound like they're from the 1990s. Before we do that, I want to have a quick look in the back of the organ. I need to pull the organ out to have a look what's in the back. And I thought you guys might like to join me. If I could have a volunteer, please, to help move the organ because it's rather heavy. In the meantime, I'm going to go and fetch my Dyson. I suspect I might need to use it. Here's the infamous pedal board. Middle D seems to be behaving itself, as do the other notes. Need to be careful with this. Would anybody like a drink? Whew. It's rather heavy. Oh. Whew. I know what some of you are thinking. Some of you are thinking, why don't I move these speakers? Well, sometimes things in life are just illogical and I can't explain it. Okay, well, let's see what we can see. Okay, that's going to get in the way, isn't it? That's the um, shutter for the front. Let's, um, uh, let's pull that down. It's, I, I do need to move these uh, flowers on the front. I'm sure you won't mind that. Well, that's the first time you've seen the organ looking like that, isn't it? Let's try again. Here we go. Holy moly. That is a lot of stuff. Whew. Those are all the stops there. Crikey. Oh, cobwebs. Um, oh, these are the original speakers and these, these are disconnected. Bit of drain pipe there. Wow, fantastic. I didn't know there was plumbing in here. What else have we got over here? More drain pipes. Crikey, look at that. Gosh, I if one of those comes loose, I have no idea what they do. <laughs> this is something that I do know. Down here are the that's the reason why I bought this organ in the first place, because it has MIDI out and in. Jolly useful for Houtwerk. One of the reasons why I'm showing you this is simply because the organ in the near future will be serviced by Viscount themselves in advance of the organ being sold to make way for the new instrument it would only be fair to give it a service. I mean, most of it works, as you know, that the stops work. It's just, it's creating a cipher, which is very, very strange indeed. Coming behind here now, where on earth would I even start to look for a, a loose cable or a, which might cause a cipher? Is it that one? that one Is it that one anyway the, there you go <laughs> cobwebs look speaker cables there I think I ought to put this organ back before I cause any damage to it frankly it looks all looks very vulnerable and susceptible to to wandering fingers and hands I think I need to make this area of the room child safe. Fortunately, I think when Hugo is walking, uh, we'll have the new organ and it'll be much safer, much cleaner and easier to understand. I'm sure there are people watching there who, who know everything about all of that stuff. Please leave me a comment if you do. I'd be very interested to know. Please leave me a comment on what you think about the state of this organ, which dates from around 1995, bearing in mind it's over 20 years old. 
it looks good from outside, doesn't it? But when you get on the inside, it's, I need to go and get that Dyson, I think. I wonder whether it's time we ought to retire the famous wire tape. What should I use instead? Leave me a comment. Well, this is a bit more of a familiar sight, isn't it? The organ is now plugged into Adobe Audition, um, and this really is the first time that this might or might not work. It's worth pointing out that all of these stop heads have been changed around. I've changed them for Hauptwerk. These stop heads actually come off. A little bit might like my new organ, but my organ hopefully should be a bit more graceful than this. So they don't correspond to the original Viscount sounds. It's going to be a game of Russian roulette. Right, where shall we start? <laughs> Two things. The swell strings, as I've labeled them, are, they sound like they're the swell strings. The second thing is I'm flabbergasted that it works straight away. I can't believe that. So that those are the swell strings. Oh, nice diapase in there. That's the twelfth. So that's a Nazard or something like that. Onto the reeds, have a look of it. Is that an oboe or a trumpet? I can't actually tell. Mixture. And then another reed. Is that a trumpet or something? Oh wait, hang on. Ah, so that's that's the tremulant. Sixteen foot. Oh, menacing. So all the reeds together there. with a nice bit of swell action at the end. Holy moly, what's that? That could be useful for the VN. Bells. That's a swell uh, pedal. Uh, where should we start the pedal? 16 foot. Eight. And 16. Another 16, another 16. This is like, this is a Russian roulette. I don't know what I'm going to get here. Sounds like a bark at the beginning. What is going on with that one? I don't know. Uh, eight foot. Uh, read. 16 foot read. Uh, four foot read, I think. Just needs one more stop. Yes, 32. It is. It even says 32 on my stop here. So that's um, that's good luck. Let's go over to this side. This is um, the great and the choir. Let's start with the choir. Chiffy flute, isn't it? What's that? Ah, under Maris. So that one. Okay, that, that's, I guess, a Dulciana or a Solitional. Trumpet. 
show me lint, clearly. Oh, a reed there. My mixture stop is a reed. Inoffensive, which leaves just one more. Clarinet or an oboe. An oboe or a clarinet? What do you think? Uh, on to the great now. So we've got 16 and 4 diapasons there. <laughs> this is <laughs> working out what these stops are. It's, it's a lot of fun actually. What is that? Like a Vox Angelica or something. What's that got, guys? Are they great strings, perhaps? I love it how dry this acoustic is. This one. Aha, finally, an eight foot reed. I'm surprised there aren't more reeds, but there's only one reed on the grate. Two mixtures, and... Voicing variation. I can't believe I almost missed voicing variation. Um, let's go for the swell strings. No difference at all. Okay, maybe it doesn't work. Let's try the reeds. Oh, now you're talking. The pedal. Let's go for the armory. Oh, the original is much better, isn't it? <laughs> um, where else do we go? A cancel. I think these just cancel the pedal. So it says uh, reads pedal cancel. I guess they're the, 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 the equivalent of the French ventils, aren't they? But then there were also some knobs down here. What have we got? Ah, um, tremulant variation. Okay, let's pull out the... <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Like an old woman. Like an old man. <laughs> Sorry. Like a middle-aged man. <laughs> I'll stop now with that. <laughs> um, the swell. Uh. Oh my god. Well, there you go, you can adjust that. <laughs> oh, there's also a, a digital reverb. Yay, so we don't need to be in this bone dry echo or non existent echo. Uh, let's try all the reeds, shall we? So all the reeds are coming on. Now, oh, that's a tremulant. One reed there. I think that was a reed. So, big C major, beginning of the sassons. Bone dry. That's like the Festival Hall in London. Now let's go to um, Caen. <laughs> oh dear. I think actually considering this is um, technology from the 1990s, it's terrific. And having this in your house um, back in the 1990s would have been just sensational wouldn't it you know years before Hamburg came along um there's a t button here and i've always suspected this is a tutty button yes it is fedor ap i suspect 
what this might do is auto pedal. Yes, it does. So what AP does, I know this because I've seen it before on, on Viscount organs, it will play the lowest note in the chord as the pedal stops. And then you can have anything else on above that and it won't play the pedal stops on those other notes. So if I play a chord up here, out of the, the, the reach of the pedal, So if you're not an organist or you don't use your feet um, when playing hymns, that's actually a really good way of playing hymns, isn't it? What I'm gonna do now, guys, is just play one or two snippets of pieces and just to show off, show off. Um I really hope you've enjoyed this video. Please leave me a comment. What do you think about this organ? Um, please let me know what you think about the inside of the organ. Please let me know your thoughts, just generally. <laughs> um, and I will see you on the next video where we will be back into Hauptwerk. Or on a real organ, you never know. Until then, I will say cheerio. Goodbye everyone, take care and stay safe. Goodbye. <laughs>